Cool deal. Um, Chris, can you just quickly share a little history about, uh, you know, the creation of Billing Bot and like what specific needs it addressed and how does it stand out from other solutions similar that are on the market? Yeah. So like I said, Billing Bot started as Invoice Bootstrapper, right? It was a PowerShell tool. It was a very rough <clears throat> kind of Band-Aid solution for uh, rebuilding Pax8 because we historically have sold a lot of Pax8 at Tech Pulse and it was something that would take seven to 10 days for somebody to go through and like manually reconcile those Pax8 charges against your invoices. Um, you know, if you're trying to bill at the first of the month and maybe then you're actually billing your Pax8 more than 30 days in arrears, there's a lot of considerations that go into rebilling distributor invoices that are really hard to get right unless you live in it every single day. And it's difficult. It's really hard. So we kind of developed that in-house tool to solve the problem for us, right? And it was a bespoke solution for Tech Pulse. Well, when we started doing Halo PSA implementations, we found that this was actually a more widespread issue uh, than we thought. And it's, you know, not even a Halo PSA deficit at all. It's all PSAs have to be built in a way that everybody can use them. And that ex excludes or precludes you from developing certain features that may be bespoke to certain markets or industries or the way that certain MSPs operate. So it's really hard, you know, to get it right. Uh, so as we were doing implementations, we we're like, you know, maybe there's, we need to bring this to the, you know, to the market. We need to bring this to the industry. The community needs this. Um, so we did it. And it's been a grueling 18 months, I think, but we did it. <laughs> and here we are. Um, you know, billing bot is out in the wild. People love it. Um, we're getting great feedback. Um, we're really proud of what we put out. Yeah, absolutely.